Warrior your pole today, bitch. Something that fits. Roll it. Is... Addicts at night. Tonight, gymnastics news, world's preview, and the men's world's team. Hello and welcome to take, I guess, like 80 of Addicts at Night. I've tried doing this so many times, y'all, and it just uh, something always happens, something like ends up not working out. Like it's, it's it's been it's been a lot. It's been a lot, but here we are. We're here. We're queer. There's no light beer, but here we are. So let's get right to it. For the past few months, former Olympian Chelsea Memel, Queen, has sorry audio. Queen has been uh, uh, posting videos of her doing insane skills from a full twist and double layout, back handspring to an Arabian, well layout step up to an Arabian to a uh, to a brawny combination, a myriad of other skills. Chelsea Memo is a beast. And I don't know how many times we got to tell y'all before you recognize that. I mean, this is a woman that landed on one foot at Worlds. Oh, and she was so strong. You only need to land on one. I mean, on one foot on beam, please. A queen, a goddess, empress, please. I love her. And today she posted, well, I guess today for me, she posted this video of her doing basically a full beam set. I mean, on floor, but still, it was impressive. So, yeah, please. I mean, can we just nominate her to the world team? Please. Uh, oh, yeah, a couple weeks ago, she sat down with uh, my gym judge to actually talk. There's a fly. Uh, she sat down with my gym judge to actually talk about a few things that are, like, really poignant. Um and compulsory. Uh, don't forget, ladies, that it is a point through deduction for artistry, and she goes on about uh, to talk about that, and it was really interesting. Um, look, I have cards; they're so official. And they're all messed up because I have to glue. We glue them. It's a mess. And this dog a pony show, I swear. Uh, Japan actually won their um, first ever group gold at the Rhythmic Gymnastics World Championships, uh, which ended on Sunday in Baku, with a score of twenty nine point five five zero in the five balls event. Japan finished second to Russia in the hoops and clubs event. Overall, Japan earned one gold and two silvers. The only other time Japan took home a gold medal was in 1975 when um, Mitsuru Hiraguchi won the individual hoop event. So congrats to y'all. Also, the U.S. Uh, women's rhythmic gymnastics team did qualify two to the Olympics, so we'll be seeing y'all in Tokyo. Hey. Uh, moving on. Oh, right. So, um, I have an issue to address. I have, I have many issues to address, but that's not here nor there. Um, and Jessica O'Byrne. Um, I have a bone to pick with you. Um, you slandered my husband, Tim Tebow, on Jim Castic this past week. And I was not here for it. I get it. Girl, he's not smart. He's not particularly bright i get it but girl lay off my husband like are we gonna have to fight i'm gonna box you jk love you girl um then we had kaylin hosh actually uh tweet about some things that my husband said but i won't repeat those because my husband's flawless thought oh yeah dennis mcintyre was actually uh well he gracefully retired I've, there's more to that story, I'm sure. Uh, Greg's really tired after 25 years. Uh, Danelle Leva actually has some really interesting things to say about that. Um, he tweeted this. And then, of course, because he can't just n not talk, Jonathan Horton showed his ass. And, yeah, that, that whole thing, I don't even know. Like, John, no one asked for your opinion, girl. No one said, John, Har John Horton? Hello, can you please comment? No, no one did. No one did that. Like, are you Jaw Rule? No, like, no, no, no one's asking. Where, jo where is John Horton? Where is Jaw? No one's asking that. No one's asking that. So just please, for the next time, like, just don't get into conversation, girl. Oh, Lainey Madsen, my queen. She uh, posted a video of her doing a five-point difficulty beam routine about if you count all the connections, and it's insane. She's going to be part of the uh, Bulgari's uh, 
a world scene, I believe, and she's going to slay. I don't care what no one says. She's coming for y'all. Y'all ain't ready for Miss Lainey. Because, honestly, Lainey Madsen is a rare case in gymnastics. She, not only is she competing at Worlds for gymnastics, but she just won Worlds for cheer. Cheer. Okay? Please. Don't count her out. Love you, girl. Mackenzie Wilford came out with her own Me Too story, uh, which is uh, sad, but... The more people talk about it, the more I feel like people feel more comfortable with just coming out and telling the story because their voices are worth it. Your voice is worth it. And don't ever feel like you shouldn't share what you've been through ever, 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 ever. I feel like uh, the only way that healing begins is if you share your own story and they, and by that you help someone else heal. Um, so I'm like really in a rush. I just want to have to get this done so I can get it edited and rendered. Go take it. Take 16 hours to render this friggin' file. <sighs> We're trying, okay. I'm here with my lonesome. I do all the research, do all the editing. It's exhausting. I'm an intern or a boyfriend or a secretary, whoever I have to pay less. Ira Alexeva actually uh, announced that she will be going to Stanford, so she'll be joining their team in the 2020 class. Um, Silver medalist in the team for Russia. Excuse me. She'll be the first Russian ever, first first Russian gymnast ever to compete in the NCAA. So that'll be interesting to watch her Stanford after E.B. Price left last year. So yeah, star power. I love that. All right. Uh, the Olympic Channel actually has a really great in-depth uh, world's preview. Scott Brickman looks so cute in it too. He's giving you angles. He's like on the ball sitting. He's like leaning on the bars. Oh, crush, stop. Just don't tell Tim Tito. Don't tell him at all. Don't even tell me. Oh my God, don't tell my mom. Don't even tell me. Oh yeah, and at the end, he busts out like a back handspring from Sid. Please, slay. Love him. Hit me up. Jim Castic actually has two episodes out. One over uh, the Department of Justice investigating the USOTC and um, US USA. USAG and C Penny. That's really interesting. And Jessica's losing her shit over it. I'm here for it too, girl. Yeah, some investigations. Oh, the other one is actually a commissioned episode, and it is about um, things you only really know if you were actually in gymnastics. And I really enjoyed listening to that. Um, check it out. Um, Spencer has a posted a preview for Worlds, a preview for the selection camp, and an overview of the Paris Cup, and that was really good to read. Well, really fun to read. I love his recaps. Uh, Jordan Weaver released it. Well, there was a video that came out of Jordan Weaver showing her coaching prowess at Arkansas. And it's just like, pig suey. I'm so excited for this season. I really am. Truly, honestly, I wouldn't lie to you. Honestly, wouldn't lie to you, truly. Uh, okay, Kaylin Okashi. Again, once again, Kaylin Okashi was in DSPN's uh, body issue. And she looked phenomenal. 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 Can you fit that? Phenomenal. I mean, I'm the one doing the graphics, so I can fit that. Phenomenal. Simone did a triple, the double, a double. Kicking gymnasts out her bubble. bubble. If you're competing against her, sorry your ass is in trouble. Might as well get the shovel and bury yourself in some rubble. Straight killing them gymnastics. Flow mat looking tragic. Four, eight, little, swole queen. What's that all on her back? Oh, it's the whole team. Hey. She was sad because she did. Uh, and the last little bit tidbit of gym news I have is uh, Nasha Lukin, 2008 All Around Champion, and uh, silver medalist on bars, beam, and bronze on floor, I think she did. I forget. She will be inducted into the United States Olympic and Paralympic Hall of Fame um, in November. Now, uh, let's just take two seconds to talk about Miss Nasha Lukin, please. Um, I'm going to interject a little segment here called At Me. Roll it. So, uh, for the past few years, Nastya Lukin has had me blocked. Hi, hey girl. How are you doing? Um, unblock me, please. And, uh, girl, it's about time you unblock me because I have some tweets to send to you. So, at Nastya Lukin. On day one of uh, the U.S. National Championships, you, I think, scanned Big Bird. And I just, I want to know, I mean, 
I get the feathered look. I do. It's a choice. But, like, is Big Bird dead? Because I haven't seen him since then. I'm just saying, girl. I mean, that was a... That was that was a choice, Nastia. I mean, that was a choice. Um, thread add, thread add next week. Um, day two, actually, you um, look. I don't know. I don't know whose quinceañera you had to go to. I don't know who speaks sixteen you missed out on. I didn't. I'm sorry, we're keeping you from your events, but Nastia, what what is this ruffle, girl? We need to talk. I will. I will hook you up, girl, because these. I, I mean, and it's, it's just the, the purple. It's not even the pink. It's like it was like a fuchsia. Not even... I don't know, girl. I don't know. But, I mean, rock on with your bad self, okay? That's all I can say. Um, I'm sniffing a lot. I don't know why. I, I have allergies. It's not cocaine or anything like that. So don't worry about that. I promise. I promise. Unless you've been living in Iraq, you know that the U.S. World Selection Camp happened. And be right before it happened, of course, as, as it is with USAG, as per usual, the Notre Dame at the office, um, they released a tweet saying that both Shelley Jones and Riley McCusker had withdrawn from the World Selection Camp. 